Hey guys, it's Amanda Place here, and welcome back to a, another video. And in today's video, it's gonna kind of be like a sequel video to my first video ever on YouTube, and that's how to install Minecraft mods. Now, that video I made quite a while ago, and I realized that I didn't explain things so clearly in that video, so I'm just gonna kind of redo it in a case uh, but if you have any questions about my other video then you can come here and hopefully your questions will be fixed um so let's just get right into it um so <laughs> first off you need to download forge so i'm just gonna type in forge and it's minecraft forge i'll put all the links in the in the description box down below but then after that, you want to click on the Minecraft version you want to download it in. So I'm going to download the 1.7.10 version. You're just going to click on that. And then after, um, it'll say 1.7.10 downloads right there. And then you want to click on the installer for the recommended. There's many different ways that you can install it, just kind of play around with it. And if Forge still doesn't install, um, keep playing around with that, and then I will show you another trick that will kind of help Forge install. But I'm just gonna save that to my desktop. And you see there's a little Java symbol there, and th th mine has that icon because I have Java, and you need Java to download Forge. And that's kind of what I struggled, not really struggled, but I didn't really address with on my other video, so uh, I, I'm i not really going to go into how to install Java, but if you want that video, let me know, but there's tons of videos out there, and you just want to click on the free Java download. I'll put this link in the description box down below, but you just want to download it, and then make sure you have the updated, the latest version, so then after that, you just want to click on it. Make sure you've already downloaded or you've already played in the version that you're downloading. So, for instance, if you're playing in 1.7.10 and you have a mod for that version, you want to make sure you've already opened Minecraft in 1.7.10 or it won't install properly. So, I'm just going to click OK and it will download everything. See, and it says mine didn't download because. I did not update Minecraft. <laughs> so hold on, just give me a second. Sorry, I had to reinstall Minecraft. That's That shows you how long it's been since I played Minecraft. So uh, apparently there's a new launcher, which I didn't know about, but you want to click on the dash march, the, the dash marks, uh, I don't know. There's a specific name for that. Uh, and you want to click on add new, uh, 1.7.10 save wait, wait I hate this launcher I, I can already say that whatever it's fine it's fine so now we can go back and change this to 1.7.10 I I really do hate this launcher I hate how you have to add each version, it's too co time consuming, but like I said earlier, <laughs> you have to make sure you're in the right version, and you opened 1.7.10, and then after that you're going to open Forge like I did earlier. So basically, like I said, you just have to troubleshoot. So, Forge is downloading. And it says it successfully installed. Now, if this doesn't work, there's tons of different methods um, to get yours to working, to be working, but I, it really just depends on what your problem is. I, usually, you can fix it by just what it's telling you. And if you have this error message, you can just type it in on YouTube or just on Google in general. So, d just keep, because I, I know that is a problem for most people um, because of my comments. So, just keep trying to work at it. 
I can't say, I can't really say like a specific problem because there are tons of problems, but I, I, I'm, I'm just, that's what I'm just saying. So now that Forge is downloaded, you can go on um, and download your mod. So in my last video, I did the Pam's Harvest Craft mod, but I realized that that's not very popular. So I'm going to download the Lucky Block mod on 1.7.10. Uh, and download it. 1.7.10 from server 1. And these are all viruses except this blue one. It's just kind of from experience. Uh, you have to play around with it, but if it comes out with like noises and stuff, obviously that's a virus, so just trying to warn you there and I'm gonna download that to my desktop see it has a little Java symbol that should have that for all mods if it doesn't have the Java symbol then it probably won't work <laughs> just from experience once again sorry it brought up an ad which is pretty popular <laughs> uh, so I have the lucky block mod right here and what you want to do is you want to go into your little file explorer thing and then type in percent app data percent go into your dot minecraft folder and you want to create a mods folder now you see mine does not have a mods folder yet because I just downloaded minecraft so what you want to do is right click it and click new oh my computer is not my computer froze <laughs> that's nice but it usually doesn't do this okay like i was saying you can just add a new folder by right clicking new folder and then folder or you can just press this button here which also adds a new folder and then I'm just going to rename this to mods. You can technically name it whatever you want to. And then you can drag your mod in there, which is 1.7.10. I'm going to delete, um, get rid of it from my desktop. But after that, all you have to do is go back into Minecraft. And then, pff, I hate this so much. You have to launch options wait wait what is it um add new and then you have to go on to 1.7.10 forge and if you do not see that then that means you did not download forge properly make sure you have java that's the number one thing i cannot stress that enough uh and then let's go back to here 1.7.104 oh it created one by itself so you didn't have to make one and then it should download properly you'll get this little different loading screen Mine. And then it will say four mods loaded. And if you, some of you guys may be confused, um, it says four mods loaded because it downloaded Forge, which takes up three mods, and then you downloaded one mod, which should show here, which says Lucky Block mod. So I'm just gonna pretty much prove that to you guys. I'm gonna go on creative. I don't really know what it's called. YouTube. <laughs> then I'll start loading the world and then okay ew I don't have a texture pack on I forgot wait did it save all my uh, wait, wait I do have a texture uh, whatever I need to mess with that later but you can obviously see that we have the lucky blocks oh crap <laughs> the lucky blocks here uh so I'm just going to open a couple of them just to prove it. See? It all works. So, 
yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, please be sure to like and subscribe. And I know this may be kind of tricky for some of you guys. And if it still doesn't work, please don't be afraid to leave some questions in the comment section down below. And if it did work, also please tell me that because I'd love to know. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!